site in the HOV lane on I-5, police issued a hefty ticket to a local woman because of who they say she had as a passenger. And she spoke exclusively to K2's Megan Cockstein. Failure to obey a traffic control device, HOV lane. <laughs> a whopping $260 ticket because Scarlett Zivertovsky was busted illegally riding in the HOV lane on I-5. And I'm rolling by in my car driving and I turn and I see a motorcycle cop and I just have this huge smile on my face. Because <laughs> I was like, yep, I am getting a ticket right now. And he just, I could tell he was definitely, I think he chuckled under his helmet I and mean, he had to have. She got the ticket because this is who or what the cop saw as her passenger. Scarlett says the officer even snatched this photo of the bizarre bear riding shotgun. I was trying to get home. I was going on a camping trip, so I was trying to get home fast. I know wasn't the right thing to do, but I had I just got over and I was like, you know, if I can just get a couple of cars ahead of me, why not? So why was she rolling around with Zeph the giant bear anyways? I was getting rid of a lot of stuff and I was like, you know what, I love this bear, but honestly, what am I gonna do with it? So maybe I thought I'll have him in my car in case I do do a stop at Goodwill or maybe give it to a little kid or somebody who's gonna be able to do a little more with it. It's taking up my closet space. He was in the back seat for a little while, but I thought I'd make my car a little cuter if he was right in the front with me, so. But the real question, did she think she'd actually get away with it? Yeah, in a way I did, because I was driving in the HOV with the teddy bear. You know, I thought I was going quick enough, and it looked like a person, but, you know, I am a good Samaritan. I normally don't break the law, so. <laughs> After she got the ticket, Scarlett took her own photo. We got sad. And says she's definitely learned her lesson. Live and learn. Definitely learned not to try to fake a passenger with a huge teddy bear. Now, Scarlett says that she has only been driving around with that bear for a couple of months. And she says as for that stunt, she's never tried that one before. She does plan on going to court, hoping to reduce that fine. We are live in Northeast Portland. Megan Cox, 9. k News. A couple of months? That takes a lot of space. It certainly does. Okay, Megan, thank you very much. Information.